explain it to, to the citizens because uh, in Portugal we have a deficit close to zero. The problem is a structural deficit. What is exactly the problem? Uh, well, uh, I think that uh, you are right saying that the people should know and they should know first of all that uh, results in Portugal were very positive in recent years. Just think to the fact that since uh, 2014, the Portuguese debt slowed down by 15 points, and that uh, next year the Portuguese budget is set to have for the first time a surplus. So we have very positive results, uh, and we have two specific uh, benchmarks on the economic surveillance process uh, of the Commission. One is the structural balance and the other one is the public expenditures where we are seeing the risk of deviation. Risk of deviations means that for these two points Portugal is with other nine uh, Euro members of the Euro area a country with a risk of deviation but I am sure that with a uh, serious commitment from the, from the government and from uh, Mario Centeno, which surely has the experience to do that, this risk will be avoided. So the, 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 the measures that uh, should be taken, and the Commission was asking for measures to be taken, is concerning the, the, the expense the expenditures? To, to take under control the public expenditure, first of all. Uh,